Welcome, brothers and sisters, welcome to another video of Topic Greece. My name is Michael, I'm the founder of Topic Greece and the Righteous Path Movement Foundation. And the topic of this video in our small series about the final puzzle piece is Test the Seven Spirits. It is written in the scripture that we need to test the spirits. Why? Because the enemy will also copy it and he will try to deceive us and he will deceive many. And it's also written that the people will be given over to a delusion so that they will believe a lie. So if you look at First John uh, chapter 4 where it's written that you need to test the spirits, then how do you test them? It is written there that every spirit that confesses, that confesses the love of God is from God. So test the spirit when they will come to you. All your messages, take it to the Lord, but also test it, that it has the love of God within. And that brings us back to the principles of the kingdom of heaven, of love, mercy and compassion. And it all begins and the highest is love. So when you test the spirit, test them if the love of God is within. If everything what the Lord has shown in the scripture will be fulfilled through the words and through the Spirit that will come to you. You will not be a fully son or daughter of the Most High or can walk as a king and priest here on earth without having received the seven spirits of God. That is what makes you a king or queen for the kingdom and a co heir with Jesus Christ. But the enemy knows this, and the enemy will try to come in, and he will try to, to bring fake spirits inside, where you can easily be diverted from your past onto the path of the New Ages, and onto the path of false religions. Therefore, when you receive messages like this, are they fitting? Are they fitting the end time and everything what the Lord has revealed? Is it for the glory of the kingdom of God, and especially, Will it show forth the love of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit? Once you have confirmed this one, then you know that you have received a new gift and a new mantle, and you will walk with these spirits, and they will help you for your, in your harvest work and in your destiny, so that you can fulfill your purpose here on earth, that you can run the final race strong that you can bring in the harvest of the ages for the Father. So test the seven spirits when they will come to you. Now you will say, how do I know they will come? When the day comes, you will. You will experience it. You will see it. It will be a glorious day. As a pattern, have a look at the Pentecostal outpouring in Acts 2. You see when this fiery tongues came, everyone was aware of it, and everyone has seen it who was involved, and so will it be with the seven spirits also. But test them. See if the information you get, the download you get, the change in your life you get, is fitting the end times and will show forth the love of the kingdom of God. Then receive them, put on the mantles, and walk with them until you have reached the finishing line at the sixth seal where you will be ruptured into paradise. And I know you all will be standing at Mount Zion, at the base of Mount Zion at that time, with offering in your hands, with a huge and great harvest. The multitude closed and white will be gathered. The house of Israel will be collected, and all will be done So Leah and Rachel. Brothers and sisters, the time is here. But never forget that the enemy is also still in the mix. And so it is necessary for all of us to test each and every spirit, each and every gift, and each and every mental that we will receive. It is better to go twice before the Lord for confirmation. It is better to pray over it three times than just to accept anything that is coming your way. The Lord will clarify it. The Holy Spirit will give you the answers and the Father will bless you. This is an important part of the final puzzle piece. The Lord has said, yes, I have given you all, all the understanding, all the wisdom, all the knowledge. 
but you need to test it. Because there is still the rebel outside. Satan is still there to deceive you. He is trying to take you away from your path. But you are prepared for a long time. You are given all the understanding so that he will not be successful. So test the seven spirits and then place the mantles on your shoulders. Your time to shine has come. Brothers and sisters, be blessed. Be blessed in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen and Amen. Maranatha.